So it is game day then in the Sky Bet League 2. Another fixture for the Bluebirds is Barrow taking on Exeter City match preview. So, what's up, guys, and welcome back to another video on the channel. By me, Barrow on tour. Yes, I'm back with another video on the channel. And today's video then is a match preview for Barrow's next fixture at Holker Street taking on Exeter City. It's one of the games in hand. So we do need to pick up some points in this game. We got this is one of the games in hand. We got another game in hand against Forest Green Rovers this month. So if we can pick up two, well, six points out of our two games in hand, that'd be massively pre that'd be massive for us. But yeah, in this match preview, then we'll be going through my predicted lineup, my score pitch, and form three beside and an update on the Skybet League Two table. But before we do get any further into this video, you know what to do. Smash like on the video and subscribe to the channel. We massively appreciate it because let's try and aim for 10 likes on this video. So the first category then that we are going to be talking about in this match preview is form for either side coming into this time. So yeah, Barrow's form coming into this game. We'll go from the 2nd of April. They got a 2-1 win against uh, Newport County, a 1-1 draw on uh, Monday against uh, Colchester and a 2-2 draw on Saturday. Upcoming fixtures then, we've got Exeter City, Leighton Orient, which is an early kick-off because of the funeral of uh, Prince Philip. Then we've got Port Vale at home, Tramier away, Forest Green away, South Bend, Exeter. So a lot, there's only about 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, Seven games left for the season to be in play. Two, we've got well, one of them, well, two of them are two games in hand. So that is our form. We got uh, winning two draws in the last three. So now we'll go over to the visitors' side in Exeter City's form coming into this tie. So then Exeter City's form coming into this coming into this tie. Then on the second of April, they got a one 0 loss against Port Vale. The 5th of April, 0-0 draw against Mansfield Town. And then on Saturday, they got a 4-1 win against Cambridge United. Their upcoming fixtures then. They've got Barrow tomorrow at 7 o'clock. Uh, uh, South End, Forest Green, Newport, Exeter, uh, Grimsby, Bolton. And then Barrow at home for the last game of the season. So, yeah, the next carry then. So, they've got a, a loss, a draw and a win. So, a bit of... Mix form for either side, so you never know what could happen in this game. It's going to be a very, very entertaining game to watch. Exeter City fans like, uh, yeah, we're going to be Barrow, we're going to be Barrow and stuff like that. So you never know if they think they're going to beat us. They're going to be they they can be like that. They can be cocky and confident, but I, I'm going to be like that. I think we can go and beat Exeter. But the next carry then that I am going to be talking about in this match preview is my predicted lineup. So then my predicted lineup coming in this tie, I think there won't be much changing of the side that uh, played against Carlisle. Well, there might be a bit of change because the four, the team performance against Carlisle wasn't the best. So I'm going to say 3-5-2 formation in Joel Dixon in goal, a back three of Bobby Thomas, James Jones and Patrick Brough. Right wing back in Brad Barry, left wing back in uh, Josh Gale. I think Josh Gale coming in the side against Exeter. Uh, two holding midfields of Chris Taylor and Jason Taylor, or Chris Taylor and Banks, maybe. And then right with uh, just behind the striker, Jamie Devitt coming back into the side, and then up front duo in Scott Quigley and Luke James. I think that'll be a decent side to get something against Sector the City on Tuesday, well, tomorrow. So, yeah, the next carry then I am going to be talking about is my score prediction. So then, Score prediction time. Then, this is the this is one of my tough things to wear. Choosing my well, my head is saying, well, my head is saying a draw, but my heart is saying a win. What do I go for? Do I go with my head or do I go with my heart? To be honest, every time you got to go with your heart. So, my heart is saying a barrel two one win against Exeter City. I think we'll get a two one win. Against Exeter, if we show character and we start off and we start off very very well. Hopefully, we can get a two-one win against Exeter City. 
But yeah, the final category then. Well, the ghosts, in my opinion, will come from uh, Exeter City, Matt J for the Bluebirds in Scott Quigley and Jamie Dever. I think Jamie Dever and Scott Quigley will score for the Bluebirds and Exeter City will be Matt. Yeah. So the final category then that we are going to be speaking about in this match preview is the update of the Skybet League 2 table. So then the final category of this match preview then is an update of the Skybet League 2 table then. So we've got new uh, lead leaders in Cheltenham Town, then in second Cambridge United only one point behind Cheltenham, third Bolton on six, seven point, four to seventh is Tramia Rovers in four, fifth Morecambe. Sixth Forest Green and seventh Newport. Just outside there is Exeter, Salford, Carlisle. Bottom half of the table then from uh, 21st is Farrell, three points behind Walsall and Mansfield. So hopefully we can there, uh, hopefully Walsall and Mansfield lose their games there on midweek, well, tomorrow. And then we could potentially move up to 19th with a point behind Stunford. 22nd then is Colchester. 23rd is South Bend, and then 24th, Rock Bottom, is Grimsby. So, yeah, nothing else I really want to say in this match preview, apart from if you have enjoyed this match preview, you know what to do. Smash like on the video and subscribe to the channel. be massively appreciative, good. And, yeah, I won't be doing a live watch long for this game, I don't think, because Streamlabs is having an absolute mare and stuff like that. So, probably I'll just do, like, a match reaction and stuff like that while I'm watching the game. But, yeah... Thank you for watching. If you haven't already, please don't forget to drop a like and subscribe to the channel. It'll be massively appreciated. And yeah, I'll see you for another video very, very soon. Peace.